Hello everyone, Orba the Chameleon, back with another diecast review. Today we are reviewing Denny Hamlin's 2006 Pocono number no. 2 win. So let's get to the box design first. Here's the front, it says race version. Here's him doing a burnout. He's done tons of those in his career. There's the date, July 23rd, 2006. The car. Here's the top, kind of a little the same thing. Actually, pretty much just the same, same thing. The side. Um, here's that button. This was one of 1,560 race win die casts from 2006 right there. And the same thing on the side, on the other side. Now let's get to the reveal. There is his race win die cast. Start with the front. There's some dirt on the front of the car. He did, this was the race, I believe, where he spun from the lead. And it came back to win the race anyway. It's the top of the car. When we open this, we're debating if this is a scratch or not. I don't know. There's a little, almost full circle from the race. Hopefully. Oh, yeah. FedEx Kinko's. In loving memory of Linda Vaughn, I'm not saying that whole name. Up here, Brookie stickers in the back is a little dirty too. We get the back up, kind of the same as the Gen Fours in reviewing all my Danny Hamlin diecast video. Of course, I can't get that up. Imagine that. Oops, knocked over my colors. It's the other side. Really, the only thing different about this is there's no circle there. All the sponsors are there. Um, this was probably a high price car. I recommend trying to find a cheaper price than what we went with. At the top, you can see inside. The Gen 4 is so much different than the Gen 6 and the Gen 7. The tires look a little worn down. Cause the design is all messed up a little. It's kind of the same way on the other side, so I'm not going to flip it around. That's when JGR was Chevy. They switched to Toyota in 2008. That's going to do it for this video. Thank you everyone for watching. Um, hope you, Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We're trying to hit 50 subscribers by the end of June. And I just want to thank you all so much for at the time of making this video. 20 views on what happened to Orbit. It really means a lot to see that you guys care about Orbit. Make sure you share the video. And there will be one more diecast review coming out. Around. Not. Not far from today, Orbit the Chameleon is out.